Hello everyone, welcome to Quantum Guruji. So today in this video we are going to see how you know how to design a uh, bigger molecules. There are some cases when we see you know uh, big molecules and uh, it's very difficult to design those kind of molecules. So how to tackle those bigger molecules and how to design that? See there are several ways to design and uh, uh, there are so many you know uh, softwares that you can use for designing your molecules. But here I will show you the easiest way for uh, like uh, in the perspective like you know, you are not a computational chemist. So it will be very very useful. So for what we will be using is the chem draw tool. Okay. So in chem draw we are having a 3D chem draw and a 2D chem draw. Okay. So we can go to the chem draw tool and there you can open uh, the 3D chem draw. So in case of 3D chem draw you will see there will be two uh, window. One window will be for your uh, two dimensional that you will be designing your molecular system and another will be for the three dimensional corresponding to that designed uh, uh, molecule. So in the case here, uh, right side if you see this right side white color uh, box, this is for 2D where that I will be designing the molecule here in the 2D and here in the left side that molecule will be uh, presented in the 3D view. Okay. So now we'll start designing some molecule and we'll see how it works. So once you click, uh, left click on your screen, white screen, you will see this tool will come here. And suppose you want to design a bulky molecule, just assume you want to design some bigger molecules with uh, so many rings and whatever size you want. So this is just an example, okay? And I will show you one uh, research level example also. Uh, will guide you how to you know how it works actually so here you see right this is suppose just assume a bigger cluster and in this case if you see here in the 3d it shows you one uh, three-dimensional structure for your system so there you can use several tools to you know so see this molecule. so here you see these are you know elongated bonds and not the exact structure right because it is trying to convert you to a, uh, 2D to 3D, so there are, there may be some flaws. Okay, so just assume uh, I will make it all uh, double bonded systems uh, as much I can. Okay, so these are the uh, you know SPD carbons. So whatever structure you got here, okay, it's, it may not be exactly same what you designed here. Okay, there may be some flaws like you see these bonds are like elongated and all. So what you can do is here you can show the MM2 minimize. This is the minimization of your molecule using molecular mechanics. Just click here. In the just quick time using molecular mechanics, it will try to you know uh, uh, optimize your molecule using a decent speed. So here you can see that molecule is optimized. And it will give you some structure. Okay, some basic structure to start your work. So it gives some good structure to start for your calculation, right? Like that you can design. Once you have designed here, uh, this is the, you know, one input structure. Now what you can do is, you know, now go to the file menu and save as. Now you can save this molecule. Suppose I will save this molecule. You know, I will open in, in Ghost View or uh, Avogadro or Spartan or some other tool. So, so that what uh, way is uh, to so save this is I'll use dot uh, mol tool. Okay, this file I'll save it or you can use dot uh, mdl mol file also dot mol file dot pdb dot sdf. So these uh, things you can open it in your boss view or some other software. Uh, but uh, the compatibility this mol two file will be compatible everywhere. I'm just saving it is a more to file. Okay. Now suppose uh, I have a Spartan. Now I'll open that molecule using Spartan, and there I will again uh, minimize uh, the geometry using uh, the default molecule mechanics, and it will again refine the structure, and we'll get some better structure. So now I leave your over here and see. So we got this structure here, right? 
now go to the build edit now click on the this energy minimization you see it has minimized and gave you the better structure to start with right now the structure you can save uh, in whatever way you want okay and uh, this will be a good starting structure right you can see uh, the structure is better than earlier so this is just an example how to design a molecule right and just assume i will take a bigger molecule or some you know research level uh, stuff i will delete this i will show you some you know the bigger stuff which is known in real world system so so this is one recent my work where i have designed the structure if you see this is a big molecule right if you start from the scratch you may forget or you may do mistake and there is a chance of mistakes huge you can forget some of the functional groups some of the bonds and all this because this molecule is a very big molecule and if even if you miss one bond or one functional group this is totally wrong right so in these cases what we will do is how to design this kind of stuff so what we do generally i have designed it so if you are starting with scratch is really painful so first what we do is uh, we drew this uh, structure in a cam draw yeah so i have the cam draw file of that structure here so i will show you how we start you know what are the ways uh, that you should do so first we will design the structure in the cam draw as a normal way okay so this is the structure now here you see see we here we are elongating the bonds and all so when we are converting into the 3d using um, cam 3d uh, there may be some flaws right you may not get a good structure i'm sorry just press control a to select the entire structure here now control c to copy now go to this uh, 3d window and here click on the white screen and control v to paste okay so now you can see in the left side you can see the uh, three dimensional structure of that structure that i have pasted here okay but this structure is not that great to start with so what we will do again we will go with this molecular mechanics it will you know uh, minimize the energy of this geometry and it will give you some better structure to start with it will take quite some time because there are so many atoms here even though it is molecular mechanics it will take uh, maybe 2 uh, to 3 minutes depending on your system okay so again you see this is at least the you know good start for your designing the uh, this kind of stuff the bigger system once uh, this is over we can export this file in that mold file and you can open that file in goes you avogadro wherever you want you can open that file okay so still this is running so this will take quite some time because this is a bigger system so still this calculation is running i don't know it will take quite some time even it at this level uh, you can see the structure it is see this is how it is moving can you see here this is moving right that is just to minimize the energy of that system so this will take quite some time and it will give you some uh, geometry and that geometry will again import into the boss view or some other software to just you know make it more better so uh, once the geometry is over like geometry optimization what you can do is you will get a one starting structure go to the file menu and save as again so you can save the structure dot mol2 maybe i'll change the name of the file once you have saved the structure you can open using whatever structure or means software you want so i'm using this spartan here 
तो टाइमिंग फाइल मेन्यू Yeah, so this structure you can locate over here, right? Now again, you can, if you want, you can just give a quick. Uh, yeah, in the edit menu, you can minimize it. It will require some time, and it will again uh, minimize the geometry using molecular mechanics, and will give you a minimum geometry. and that you can again start for your calculations what over thing you want so this is the way to you know design a new molecule which is bigger and that you cannot design using normal designing tool so uh, like this you can design your molecule thank you